Today we're playing for the Mitsubishi Lancer WRC05. It's a really high RQ off-road four-wheel drive rally car. Let's get on with it. Hey, I'm Mike. Today we're going to play for this Mitsubishi Lancer WRC05. It is a really high RQ rally car. It looks a lot like all the other ones, but it is, I think, one of the better ones. Really good handling figure. Let's start by getting the results for the quals. I got tier one for the quals, which meant I got the epic, which I didn't really need. I already have it. But here we go. Let's go. Chevrolet, Mitsubishi, Buick, Audi Super Rare, BMW Ultra Rare, there's the Audi, and we're done. So, I didn't really need that. I don't even think it's gonna be useful in the finals, but tier one is cool. Right, let's just run through the last round of the tune-up and claim that pack. This is my new style of tri-series. It makes for a much easier video to edit and a much quicker video for you guys to watch. If there is something exciting happening in the quals or the prelims, I will do some videoing and make sure you get to hear about it. But in the meantime, let's just get this pack open and see what it is. Nissan, Chevrolet, Bristol, Super Rare Volvo, and an Audi S4. Okay, for the prelims, I am again just gonna show you the results. I got tier two. Just a point of note, my trophy count's gone over 100,000. That's pretty cool, isn't it? Here we go, here's the pack. Germany, Sweden, 1990s. Mitsubishi, Citroen, Rover, Super Revolvo, and an Audi A4 and a Porsche 911. Sorry, that Audi was the guaranteed card and the Porsche was the pack card. That's too fused material for me. Okay, day of the finals has arrived. I'm joining the night before, 22 hours to go. We are, of course, playing for the Mitsubishi Lancer. The track sets are two wet and three dry. That's all you need to know. Nothing too busy. There is a short drag and all that kind of stuff, but reasonably, it's two wet, three dry. I am using my five best cars, effectively. So I am not using the Audi that was from the Quals. It's not upgraded. I will be using a Porsche 911 gold one, a Porsche 911, an Audi V8, a Roof CTR, and a Porsche 911. And that's hopefully gonna get me tier one, tier two. Let's see. There are quite a few upgrades in my legendaries from previous Tri-Series, and also that Roof CTR has had two upgrades in it for this finals. Basically, it is now 113 because otherwise it would have probably lost the epic, which would have been really, really distressing. Anyway, that's our first win under the belt 53rd 1 0. Okay, let's go again. We've got 149 people in our 500 bracket. Let's rattle through the five tickets and see where we are. We shouldn't be struggling too much. There is that um, on the fifth race, there's that RQ84 four wheel drive Volkswagen. I think, unless it's maxed, I should be okay against it. I'm hoping these aren't the kind of cars people have been maxing. Obviously, I have a few upgrades in them, which um, suggests that some people are upgrading them. Anyway, that's win number two. I imagine most of the top 20, even the top 30, will have this gold Porsche. It's been around a lot of time, and it's got good handling, and it's a good car. Same with the other Porsche Epic. The other three cars, obviously, as you read, are harder to pull and much harder to upgrade. Okay, that's another win. Three and zero, 27th. Okay, the hands, they're still ultra rares and epics. The hands will be getting harder as we go up, but it is quite an empty bracket. It's not even a third full yet, so the chances are the hands will get harder as the bracket fills up overnight. Certainly, I don't expect to be meeting many people with that gold Porsche that hasn't been maxed when we get to the top. Right, so let's get some cards. Okay, let's play the fifth ticket, and then we'll see where we are. This um, Porsche 911, wherever possible, I'm gonna put it on the car park, the dry car park, because it is 
definitely um, got the best handling out of all of them. Okay, that's five tickets done. And we've cleared the prize board. Good. So let's have a look. We're 152 people in the bracket, 15th. But there'll be a lot of people on five and zero. So um, go at the top, Piggy is seven and one. Not seeing many names I recognize. There's a couple there, but um, let's hope we've got a good bracket. Okay, I'm back. It's the next morning. I'm at the top, 13 and zero. The bracket is filled up, but I'm not sure if the people at the top are going to be the people at the top at the end. Obviously, people will still be sleeping and will be waking up to this and playing their tickets. So this is the guy who's second at the moment, HK. He has a good hand. The other ones look very doable. I'm not about to play the guy in second particularly. We'll play the guy in fourth and we'll see if we can um, maintain our position. I know in the past I've bleated on about not sticking your head above and not being first in a tri-series because you become a target and all that kind of stuff. But I don't have long left. I've got to play 14 more tickets and I've got to get them in in the next 12 hours. So I'm going to have to play my tickets and if I stick my head up, then so be it. I stick my head up. If people can hit me, then that's fair enough. But I think at the moment I have the dominant hand, so that should be fine. Okay, that looks doable. G-Force. So he's got the Audi that I didn't want to bother upgrading and I imagine most people aren't going to want to bother upgrading. I imagine this guy's probably going to swap that out at some point if he's got a better car. Four-wheel drive Porsche with that kind of trophy count. Okay. But sometimes people just don't have the cars. That's how the game works. Okay. So another win under my belt anyway. Right, so let's play someone different. He will do. He's got a big trophy count as well. Okay, G-Force. Other two on the dry, and then there's two on the wet. It's not a difficult track set to mess with. Don't need to think too much about it unless people put weird things on. Like putting your four-wheel drive cars on the dry and all that kind of stuff. It shouldn't be too difficult to play in the heat of the moment at the end. Okay, 16 and 0. Okay, I'm 34 and 0. I am at the top of the table. No losses. There's a few people around me with good hands, but no one that can beat me. I've played all my tickets. I don't need to play any more tickets. So let's play one more ticket for the video and then I will just monitor the situation for the rest of the evening. Okay, this guy has a quite a good hand, but at least two of the cars are very beatable. And luckily the track set works for this car park on the first one, which gets my gold Porsche, beats out that legendary. The other two wet track cars do lose though to that guy. Okay, that's one more win anyway. As I say, I am already qualifying for tier one. I don't think I'm going to get knocked down now. So we'll leave it there. Okay, we've got the results. I did get first. Nobody hit me. It's all good. Double carbon fiber and the price car. Let's go. Nissan. Peugeot. Chevrolet, Dodge, another Dodge, Mini, Ford Super Rare, a Bizzarini Super Rare, Ford Bronco Ultra and a Mazda Ultra and there's the prize car. Awesome. It was not a struggle at all. This one was an easy one for me, but that is a great prize car to win. Very pleased. It's certainly up there with the top three or four good off-road cars that I own. So pretty pleased with that, really. Let's add it into the garage. And we'll one-star it. Let's have a look at the off-roaders. Yeah, so it's in the top three, top four, top five. There's a lot of 93s, in fact, actually. We'll one-star it, see what it looks like. It certainly doesn't have the 0-60 that some of them have. Hopefully it makes up with some sort of MOI or something to equate to an RQ93. Very pleased with that anyway. Let me know in the comments how you got on in your bracket. If you had an easy bracket and you win the prize car or if you struggled a bit. I'd like to hear from you. Thank you very much for watching. Please do hit that subscribe button. All that kind of stuff. Get yourself out of here. We are done.